so this is our first time being together I think since we started really yep. um but in case you don't know I'm Maddie I'm Holly and we are the mother-daughter duo behind coffee water wine so like we said this is the first time we actually got to spend time with each other since the whole coronavirus COVID-19 thing happened. So we've both been at home, we've both been quarantining. So we decided that it was a good time to, I came over here and we we're gonna drink wine. In 3D. In 3D, yeah. Cause In it's 3D. just been over the phone. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So here we go. So tell them about our challenge, Maddie. Yeah, so I wanted to do something fun. My sister is taking photos, if you see me looking <laughs> off. And then uh, we have, Linward, my stepdad, our, our uh, bar, bartender, our in-house bartender. Um, so what we're doing is he went out and bought three different bottles of wine from a variety, like three different price points. And Linward, what were the what were they? They were? $20, $40, and $60. Okay, so yeah, $20, $40, and $60. And so we have, we each have three glasses of wine. I think Linward's playing along with us. And they're numbered. <laughs> he, he picked the best one he's already drinking. So, um, we have to go through, we're going to talk about each one and then place where we think each one belongs. Yep. So, and then, Ooh, can I, can we have the, uh, expo marker, Evan, so we can write the price point on the, on the glass. Thank you. Okay. That's a good idea. Okay. So you want to start with number one? Yeah. Let's start. Oh, okay. you know me. I like, I'm a rule follower. Rule follower. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So we're going to talk about like each one as we go. Keeping in mind, we're wine drinkers, not wine experts here. Has like a raisiny kind of aftertaste. Also, watching yourself drink wine, it's not pretty. Yeah. <laughs> this is why I did a podcast. I didn't have to watch mm -hmm. myself. All right. Let's see. Are we going to teamwork this or are we going to be competitive? I feel like we should like talk about it because I feel like that's content. Well, I thought that. I would move on to the next one. I can't judge that one. Till I what are your or just like thoughts on it though, as a glass of wine? I like it. It's not my favorite. I think it needs air. It definitely needs air. Mm -hmm. It's a little strong. It's in the probably front. the most expensive one, and I'm like, it's not good. <laughs> no, I like it. I just feel like it needs a lot of air. Needs air. All right, let's move that one aside. Okay. Number two. I'm going to start with some water real quick. Yeah. All right. I'm pretty long with you. Mm. did you just fin finish number one? Not yet. All right. What are your thoughts? Um, well, I, I mean, I know. So, I mean, I, I mean, I <laughs> Do you, I, so I you, you, so you <laughs> he's turning his back and pouring a second glass. All right. So right, on to number cheers. two. Cheers. We missed our first cheers. Yeah, we did. All right. Do Good. you get anything off the nose? I'm not grabbing anything distinct off, off the first whiff. This is good. This one's this, smoother. This, yeah, this is definitely. I like this one more. Creamier. Very, yeah, a hundred percent. I like this one so much more. It's less um, acidic, like it's less abrasive on my palate. Mm-hmm, yes. And the thing is, is like, even if one is our cheapest, it's still a $20 bottle of wine. That is right. Like our cheapest is still 20, which mm -hmm. was like out of my price range as a college student. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah. yeah I gotta, we'll have to wait. Okay. Like I'm not it. loving watching myself drink wine. It's not pretty. <laughs> I, can't, I can't do it. <laughs> All right. I really like this one. I like number two. I'm putting a smiley face on number two for now. All right. Number two, Maddie's got a smiley. Mm-hmm. All right. I'm, I'm, I'm reserving. I'm did not you, making any... Did you match um, me on purpose? No, I did not. I was wearing purple. The first one I've got... Exactly from both of you, and Maddie said raisin. Right, yep. Um, my very professional wine opinion. I mean, it's. it's oh, I like three sober. Smell. One is still I my smell. least favorite. I smell tobacco. I remember John and I went to a wine tasting one time, and um, it was a blind wine tasting. It was a bunch of wine. And one of the last ones, you got like notes, 
and you had two bottle, two glasses of wine and like six or so different notes to guess from. Like you had to guess what the, what the notes were and which one was which. And two of the notes were meat and gravel. And- You would have guessed those. The ones we, yeah, there was one wine we all hated and we're like, that one's gotta be meat and gravel. And John's like, that's called roadkill. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, see, I need to, I need the cheat sheet. I need yeah. a word bank. All right, number three. All right, so oh. this one you said, uh... Three smells really good. I think, hold on. It smelled good first one. This one needs some air too. I smelled really good at first. But it smells better than number one did. It smells like one of my wines from Dry Creek that I had. It was better on day two. It's softer than this one, I feel like, maybe. Smooth. This is number three? Mm -hmm. Mm hmm I like the aftertaste. Yeah. It's like if you mix one and three, one and two together, I feel like you would get three. Okay. Oh, it's really good though. I feel like I'm not picking up any notes of anything. I'm like, this is wine. And I usually can suss out something. It's a little floral. The, there's, a, there's something on that, the smell, I can't. All right, let's I go back and look at my legs. Look. I got good legs. Very good legs. It was it was creamy. Creamy. Um. No, look at the. There's not many legs on this one. On that one and two. This is two. Really? I have I have legs on one on two. Look, that's two. Okay. Let's make the my swirl. Um. Yeah. Two was really creamy. We liked it. You get, I don't know, I kind of get tobacco on that one, but also part of me struggles because I feel like the glass smells from like the cabinet. Are these from upstairs? These are, these, these glasses are pretty heavily used. I know, but <laughs> I still don't sit long. <laughs> but I feel like I can smell the cabinet. That's how I feel about three. All right, Maddie. I liked number two. Uh, one thing I've got, all right, this is what I've got. I've got Dita air for number one, tobacco. One's Ladies are getting two. better. Number two, all I've got is creepy. And then uh, three, I've got needs air again. Smooth aftertaste. I'm still not I loving it. One dries my mouth out. Maddie One is very dry. And the floor is amazing. I have very few comments from number two. Y'all got anything else? Let me go back. Did you get my nice legs? I'm glad Linward's. Nice no, number two. Uh, no, no, nice legs was on three. I'm sorry, you're right. I'm glad Linward's documenting this. your notes for two. Oh, that's creamy. No, no. Three was creamy too, though, he said, but not one. You know, <laughs> you know what that last smell number three gave me? It reminds me of <laughs> like walking into a horse stable. <laughs> like a horse, and I don't mean like the poop, but just like the oaky, woody, mm -hmm. like outdoorsy, I'm gonna say cherries, maybe. The plums on two, two. I, I was fruity. It's like bing, it make a Bing cherry in the finish. Bing cherry. Yeah. All right, Maddie. The moment of truth. How, how do we do? I finished number two. <laughs> That's how we do. So which one are you drinking? You drinking one or three? Huh? I feel like we're bouncing around. I'm on three again. I like two and three. I'm still not a huge fan of one, which is gonna be really funny if it's. The most expensive because I usually always like the most expensive. All right. All right. Let me let me pour some number three here. And <laughs> see what you two are up to. Mm. Better. I'm on three. You're on one. No, I'm oh, on three. Oh, you moved. You moved yours. No, that was not fun. Oh, they've been like that. Okay. I kind of got cherry on three, and I don't know if it's like a placebo thing, like you said, and I'm thinking cherry now. Hmm. Yours are the reverse of mine. Yeah. I have one. One on my right. Alright, on two, all I got is creamy and cherry. <laughs> That's it. I got needs air, tobacco on one, raisiny. <laughs> Number three, I've got needs air, Maddie likes, smooth, nice legs, good aftertaste, floral, creamy. 
That one three. Three's got a lot of notes. I finished two. Three is light. Three is three is the lightest, I would yes, say. Yes, three is the lightest. They're all good and dry. Yeah. One did you have dry for one? Because one is very drying on the palette. One is outstandingly dry yeah. in my opinion. This is hard. This is hard. We'll never make the Smalia test. <laughs> we can try though. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna take a stab at my pricing. Okay, yeah, I'm thinking. Let me try one more time. I think mine might. That can't be. That can't be it. That's like I got. That's gotta be wrong. Right. I'm going three is twenty. See, I think I have three is sixty. You want three at twenty of those? Mm-hmm. See, I, that can't be right. Like one, two, three, it can't be in that order. That's too easy. That's gotta be wrong. I, I did, I did, oh, I got remnants. Hold on. What do you think two is? I'm going 40. 60. Okay. So our two is the same. See, I was wondering if I should flip. You said two was 40. And one was 60. I'm wondering if I should flip and if I should do 60, 40 instead. Flip those two. But you've had a lot more expensive wine than I've had. But I just feel like that can't, like, I don't feel like Leonard would have done 20, 40, 60. <sighs> All right. So I have... Number one is $20. Um, I have number two. Oh, this is hard. <laughs> I'm just gonna drink. <laughs> um, I have number two as, I'm gonna, I'm, I can't decide if this is a 40 or $60, but I'm gonna just say 60 for number two. You know what? It's a win-win because all the wines are open, drink. so we have to drink them now. <laughs> I just don't want more of number one right now. Okay, so I have number two is 60, number three is 40. Number two is 60. Yeah. And number three is 40. Yeah. All right, Lamar, moment of truth. Do you want to come over here and read it out? Or do you want to like, show us the bottles? I, I can just, I'll just tell you. Can you hand us the bottles? Yeah, let's have the bottles. Let's bring out the bottles real quick, and then right. we'll do it. All right. Here's the bottles. All right, because don't tell us here the price. I knew well. Oh, Don't tell us the price yet. We'll lay them out. So, mom already knows probably. So we have Arrowwood, Arrowwood um, 2016 Cabernet Sauvignon Alexander Valley. One of Linwood's favorites. Well, but it's not really. It's, that's not really Alexander Valley. It, Ooh, this know, is one of the new ones. That is. That is the. Uh, yes. Okay. Yay! So then we have another Arrowwood. Um, Which is the new one, the Vale's Edge. Yeah. Vale's Edge, new. It's a 2016 Cabernet Sauvignon. These are out of our new spring delivery. Very exciting. This is number two, this is number one. And then, I didn't like this one. the one that we've all been waiting for. <laughs> <laughs> the Hess Select. Number three. Oh my gosh. <laughs> number three, Hess Select. Okay, so he put it. Wait, wait, wait. Isn't this part of our Kroger click uh, wine list? Um, well, oh. Yes. I, I'm not sure because I, I didn't get that one from Kroger, but I think it is. Oh, no, no. Okay. So number one, like I said, was the Arrowwood 2016 Cabernet Sauvignon Alexander Valley. Number one, I had this as $20. Mom, you had it as 60 60 And Linward, the price is? Retails uh, for? It is 40 40. Oh. So this is our middle one, which I think we both we bought, got that wrong. Okay. So I think maybe so I got obviously I got the other one wrong. <laughs> <laughs> so then we, number two, Arrowwood Vale's Edge 2016 Cab Sav. Number two, I had it as 60. I had that one as 40. Mom had it as 40. Retails for? Uh, $60. $60. Yeah, exactly. Oh, I got that one right. Yay. So that means I got two right. <laughs> and then Hess Select. Uh, another Cabernet Sauvignon, North Coast. Number three, I had it as 20. 40. 40. A 40? No, that's 20. And Holly had that 20. Yeah, so I got that one right. No. I, yeah, number three is four, $20. Yeah. Did I get that one wrong? Did I only get one right? Yes, you, you only got, yes, you did. Y'all both got the, uh, 
I got one and two backwards. Holly got one and two backwards. So I got three right. So this one has select retails for what? It's 20. $20? Yeah, this is this is from our Kroger collection, but um, under the wine's under $30. Okay, so I listed this one as 40 as $40 and it retails for 20. Um, so this was what my second favorite, I think. That is your second favorite, Maddie. Yes, your your first your favorite was the most expensive, which was the Bales Bales Valley. Is that what it is? That checks out. Bales Ridge or something. It's a new wine. It's the first time we've ever. Yeah. So number two was our most expensive, right? Mm -hmm. So it went most expensive was number two, number one, mm -hmm. two, two, one, and then three. Yeah. So I got one and two. The two arrow was. Backwards. Yeah. And the only one I guess was the was okay. So I got the other two flipped around. What's it called? Bale's Edge. Is that the name of it? Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, Arrowwood. It was our favorite winery when we were in Sonoma. It was that in Deerfield. And, and they also brought uh, the original winemaker from Arrowwood who opened the winery. He was left in 1985, but they brought him back to make this wine with the current wine. And that was number two, right? Mm -hmm. That was so good. I, number two is good. Number two is really good, and it just shows goes to show you that like I thought this for I I almost had this as a sixty dollar bottle of wine. So oh, you changed at the last minute. I did, yeah, because yeah. this was this was number three. I had it at sixty, and I changed it to forty because I I knew I couldn't just do twenty, forty, sixty. So if you're looking <laughs> for, for a good wine that's tastes like a sixty dollar bottle of wine, in my opinion, what did you have it as down? You had it as the twenty. Yeah, I thought it was really good. <laughs> <laughs> it's the Hess Select. Also, another one, I've told you about this, Dad and Laura have gone to a blind wine tasting in the Josh, I think it's the cab, I'm not sure. Mm -hmm. That one has gotten, every time people end up picking, they like bracket their wine, mm -hmm. and that one is like, that was the top winner from when they went. So That is not your favorite, the Josh. I'll get it every now and then when I'm like, I just grab a bottle at the grocery store. But anyways, that was really fun. That was fun. Um, we're gonna do a post about this, so you'll find this on coffeewaterwine.com. Um, yeah, so hope you enjoyed. Linward, thanks for bartending. Yay, thank you, Linward. That was fun. Bye. Now we have to drink wine. Bye. Yes, bye. <laughs>